God is saying to you today, it is said that God has a plan for each one of us, and sometimes, He communicates this plan to us through signs and symbols. These signs are not always obvious or easy to interpret, but they can contain important messages and opportunities for blessings in our lives. According to the topic at hand, it seems that God has been trying to send some crucial signs to an individual, and unfortunately, two of these signs were missed yesterday. This is a matter of great concern, as these signs were intended to bless this person in the year 2024. Type 1111 if you are ready. It is important to understand that when we miss a sign from God, we are not only missing out on a potential blessing, but we may also be delaying or hindering the fulfillment of His plan for our lives. God's plan for us is always good, and it is designed to bring us peace, joy, and fulfillment. When we ignore or neglect His signs, we are essentially turning away from the path that He has laid out for us. However, the good news is that it is not too late. God is giving us another chance to receive the blessings that He has intended for us. There is still one last sign that we can look out for in 2024, and it is crucial that we don't miss it. This sign may come in many different forms, such as a chance encounter, a sudden opportunity, or a divine revelation. Whatever form it takes, we must be open and receptive to it, and we must be willing to follow where it leads us. Type, I am open to miracles, to affirm. It is also important to note that receiving God's blessings is not just about us. When we are blessed, we are able to bless others in turn. By following God's plan for our lives, we can become instruments of His love and grace in the world. We can make a positive impact on the people around us, and we can help to build a better, more just, and more compassionate society. So, let us not waste any more time. Let us be on the lookout for the last sign that God is sending us in 2024. Let us open our hearts and minds to receive it, and let us be willing to follow where it leads us. By doing so, we can tap into the abundant blessings that God has in store for us, and we can become the best version of ourselves that we can be. New Month, New Intentions Realize that every moment you have a choice to choose your vibration through what you give your energy to. Right now, more than ever you're being asked to embody your highest light, Walk as your sovereign self and live authentically as well as unapologetically. You're meant for so much more and you're being asked to remember that. Stay optimistic and be consistent in feeding your mind, body and soul. Abundance. You don't have to force, fight, or figure out your entire life plan at once. Let the worry go. Your doubt is only a distraction and a delay. Relax. What's meant for you is constantly flowing to you. Continue to let life surprise and guide you to where you need to go. Remember, you are continually advancing and attracting more. Trust the timing of how it all unfolds. Type. I am ready to affirm. The universe is saying to you today, life is like a game simulation. You're part of a team. Your teammates consisting of angels, ancestors, 
Galactic quids of light, etc., are in the control room, and you're the chosen soldier who has stepped up to go into the game. Battlefield Simulation. Now you have the equipments to communicate with your team. When in the simulation, your teammates in the control room will be directing and guiding you each step of the way so you can complete the mission and come out successfully. It is extremely important that you have this constant communication with your team. To receive guidance, directions, information and to report back your situation and ask for what you need. Meditation helps to recharge the connection when there are any disruptions or low signal. Many forget that they have a team guiding them and end up getting lost and struggle in the simulation. Type 1111 if you believe. Stop worrying. You've been good enough all along. You're way too good to be replaceable. So get that image out of your head. You need to realize you're a gem, a keeper, one of the rare souls. You're somebody worth having around, not somebody who can easily be forgotten. You're the type where after you, everyone gets compared to you and falls short. That's how special you are. So don't you dare lose confidence due to people's inability to see your worth. Tell your insecurities to buzz off. It's time you start believing in who you are and what you have to offer. People are going to do you wrong regardless. But remember that's their loss, not yours. Believe me, after all is said and done, they'll still try and find their way back to you even when it's too late. Tonight I release all energies that do not belong with me and ask that karma clears. I let go of old belief systems, unhealthy habits, obsessive thoughts, irrational fears, regret, anger, disappointment, harmful behaviors and generational trauma. I am magnetically attracting all that I vibrationally align with. I invite new magical energy into my life. I welcome transformational change and I am worthy of deep love, miracles and magnificence. With gratitude I accept the blessings, good fortune and opportunities that are meant for me. You will never know if something is meant for you if you don't give it a proper chance. Whether it's a relationship, a new job, a new city, or a new experience, throw yourself into it completely and don't hold back. If it doesn't work out then it probably wasn't meant for you and you'll walk away without regret, knowing that you put your whole heart into it. That's all you can ever do. It's a horrible feeling leaving a situation knowing that you should have and could have done more. So find the courage to take that chance. Find the inspiration to make your next move. And once you do, pour your heart into it and don't look back. Type. I am ready to affirm. What you're about to discover today is life changing. One minute you're struggling to pay bills. Swamped with money worries and the next minute. You're attracting money like steel to a magnet. What makes this life-changing difference in people's lives? It's called the genetic wealth code once you activate it. Your life will never be the same again. You can activate your genetic wealth code here today. It's best to activate this code now, while this page is still live. Tap the link in my comments to activate your genetic wealth code. Every time you get triggered, you have an opportunity to take your power back. But if you project instead, 
you're only creating more suffering for yourself because you're not working in harmony with your higher self. Many of you are receiving signs and symptoms from your body to slow down and rejuvenate yourself because you're being upgraded energetically. It's very easy to fall into the trap of your ego when you haven't mastered connecting with your inner dragon that's even more powerful than the false self because it helps you master your inner light. The ego is a cloud of illusion that fades away the moment you become aware of your unconscious patterns or behaviors and question yourself to your own highest evolvement. Type. 444. If you're ready, I know that you are tired of waiting for your desires to show up. However, very often we haven't learned the spiritual lessons that would allow us to not only fully enjoy what we desire, but handle it too. The universe will only ever give us what we can handle when we can handle it, all at a pace that we can enjoy. Therefore, any moment that you find yourself getting angry at the universe for not giving you what you want, be thankful. Recognize that the universe is only protecting you. Right now, the universe is currently organizing situations and events that will lead you to your success. And it is all arriving in divine timing. Type. I'm ready to affirm. I am planting new seeds and walking on new paths. My spirit is transforming along with my thoughts, words, and actions. I am upgrading my life on every level. Positive energy is constantly shifting the course of my journey. I am achieving my goals, one divine step at a time. The universe responds to my gratitude with more blessings, more miracles, and more magic. I am flowing on a wave much higher than where I used to be. The view from up here is incredible. Not everyone deserves to have access to it. Not everyone is okay to feel overwhelmed by the various things you feel you need to figure out. But you just need to take one step at a time with clarity instead of figuring out what the whole staircase looks like. You're learning many new things, so be easy on yourself if you make mistakes or fall. Don't allow your ego to compare you with others. It's a childhood conditioning used as negative motivation. You're divine in all your forms and phases. Type, I accept myself, to affirm. Magic deserves to be surrounded by it. Not everyone deserves to emotionally and mentally benefit from it. Save your high vibrating energy for those who genuinely care for the evolution of your spirit. You soul is golden, not many like O oh, you have been created. A gem this rare is bound to attract all sorts of characters. It's up to you to decide how close one ETS to it. There's no telling where the universe will take you next, but you know it will take you far. A soul like yours was made to go the distance. It's okay if you didn't realize until now that you're a walking diamond. The more pressure that's applied, the more dazzling you become. When the things you want are slow to come to you, suspend your desires. Give them up for a bit. Wanting something is a beautiful thing, but it inherently carries resistance with it. Usually because of the fact that we put off being happy or content until we have it. So as an energy hack, give it up for a while, and find contentment in your present state. Paradoxically, by feeling fulfilled as is, you become aligned with the frequency of all your desires. 
In other words, in order to productively desire something, release the need, conditions, and attachment to it. Type. I am love. To affirm. God is saying to you today, I know you have been questioning yourself lately and wondering if you are really strong enough or good enough to do what I placed in your heart to do. This message is here to remind you that you can do all things through Christ. Don't you dare give up or let fear talk you out of your dream. Remember, I am with you and you will succeed. You can do this. Check bio link to secret of attract money. Link in comment section. Your story is about to change so epically. It's going to make your heart and head spin. All the time and effort you put into mastering yourself is about to satisfyingly pay off. The way your journey has been set up is a pure work of art. This next breakthrough is going to confirm that. Every ounce of magic in you is about to triple in size. Take a second to enjoy the present moment. It won't be this way for much longer. You're approaching the final steps of the tunnel, but you're slowly realizing that the light you were chasing at the end of it always stemmed from within you. Be at peace. Your next chapter is going to leave a permanent smile on your face and a lifetime of joy in your soul. If someone is not treating you with love and respect, it is a gift if they walk away from you. If that person doesn't walk away, you will surely endure many years of suffering with him or her. Walking away may hurt for a while, but your heart will eventually heal. Then you can choose what you really want. You will find that you don't need to trust others as much as you need to trust yourself to make the right choices. You're on the right path. Don't let your ego get in the way. Trust your intuition and inner knowing. You're being realigned to the reality of fulfillment, contentment, and rewards. Whatever wasn't aligned is being cleared out of your way. Paint the vision of the new reality while staying grounded in your current reality. Be fearless by facing your fears, limited beliefs, obligatory conditioning in the face and consciously breaking out of it. Embrace change. Type. I appreciate myself. To affirm. They may laugh. They may criticize. They may misunderstand. They may think that you are crazy. Including and especially people that are close to you, your loved ones and your family. They will all be so concerned with your change because it reflects your urge, your deep desire and burning fire for growth, to push past limits, fears and become who you truly are. This resistance is natural and occurred in all times for everyone who have ever reached the greatest level of success personal legend. For everyone who have ever freed themselves of society's forced beliefs, perceptions of reality, and what is considered as normal. For everyone who have mastered their way of being. Don't get caught up in the noise. Listen to your own soul. There is magnificent guiding system within you that is leading you home to yourself. A person who enjoys solitude always gives others their space. No matter what kind of a relationship it is, healthy space nourishes the connection. But when someone is uncomfortable with solitude, they become codependent. Such people become so dependent on others that they don't let them breathe. Solitude is the foundation of self-love 
A person who enjoys their own company knows themselves on a soul level. When someone truly loves themselves, they give others space not out of obligation, but out of love. Giving others space is like setting them free and the more you let go, the deeper the connection gets. The ego thinks love is possession, but it's actually giving the other the freedom to be themselves. Type, I claim it, if you receive this declaration. Activate the flow of unlimited wealth, happiness, pleasure, freedom, and confidence into your life by making one tiny change to your morning routine. Would you want it? Check link in comments below to know the wealth secrets to attract an abundance of wealth. There are times that you wish you had started sooner that you had taken the spiritual turn earlier and realized how to navigate your life more thoroughly at an earlier age. But it doesn't work that way. You're in this position now because of the very lessons, twists, and turns you ultimately went through. You had to get lost in order to find your way. That's what makes the entire experience even more fulfilling. The breakthroughs that are on their way to you wouldn't be as special if you had it from the very start. This is all by design. You're not late. You're not missing anything. You're on divine time. Type. I trust and surrender to affirm. A person who enjoys solitude always gives others their space. No matter what kind of a relationship it is, healthy space nourishes the connection. But when someone is uncomfortable with solitude, they become codependent. Such people become so dependent on others that they don't let them breathe. Solitude is the foundation of self-love. A person who enjoys their own company knows themselves on a soul level. When someone truly loves themselves, they give others space not out of obligation, but out of love. Giving others space is like setting them free and the more you let go, the deeper the connection gets. The ego thinks love is possession, but it's actually giving the other the freedom to be themselves. Set new intentions for the new month and embody the new version of you. When you keep seeing yourself as your older self, you find excuses to repeat what's not serving you anymore. It's important to question your own patterns and consciously break them. You are safely guided and protected by the higher forces of the universe. Ask for guidance and you shall receive it immediately because you're being surrounded by your etheric team. Type, I embody my higher self to affirm. 777 don't confuse character with reputation. A lot of toxic people and energy vampires have a great reputation, but their character is really ugly. Such people are masters at manipulating others and maintaining a facade. They never reveal their true intentions and always keep others oblivious of who they truly are. On the other hand, the people who have pure intentions and giving nature have a good character, but their reputation is not necessarily good as they don't play any manipulative games and try to keep up with a false image, they are mostly made out to be the villain by the manipulators. Appearances can be deceiving. Train yourself to see beyond the facade so that you don't get deceived. The universe always supports a good character, but the people who deceive others will meet their karma. Move with pure intentions, stay real. Type, I am ready to affirm. 
When you start living differently from the masses, it makes everyone uncomfortable. The fact that you no longer play the same game of fear and drama like you were conditioned to, makes everyone aware of their own limitations. When you operate on an absolute authentic frequency, people don't even know how to approach you anymore because you outgrow their energy. When you are different, people don't know where to fit you anymore, your existence transcends their preconceived ideas. You won't be able to meet people's expectations anymore because you're not the same person anymore and you no longer operate on the same frequencies. Embrace your growth. Type. I trust and surrender. To affirm. If you want to attract huge money effortlessly, starting today, check link in comments below to know the shocking wealth secrets revealed by rogue NASA scientists. Subscribe our channel if you believe in God. 888 I'm highly observant, and I've come to realize that I don't always require evidence to validate what I know. I observe patterns, pay attention to tone of voice, and above all, I listen to the energy around me. If I no longer vibe with someone, it's because attempts to discuss things have led to drama. Therefore, I've now chosen to prioritize my peace over their disrespect. You gotta face your deepest fears in order to align with your soul mission. Everything that makes you fearful has a very specific purpose from a higher perspective. Every time you face your fears, you unravel a deeper layer within yourself. The universe makes you go through certain situations so that you can grow through your fears and it's all part of your spirit's divine blueprint. Start approaching your fears as they are the doors to unlock the next level of your life and you will understand that all the greatest lessons are on other side of your fears. Don't run away from your fears. They are in your life for a very specific purpose. Trust the blueprint that the universe has designed for you. Everything is connected. Type. I'm optimistic. If you're ready. As we move through life, many of us search for signs and guidance from a higher power. We believe that God communicates with us in subtle ways, sending us messages to help us navigate our journey and lead fulfilling lives. Sometimes, however, we may overlook these signs or misunderstand their meaning. In 2024, it seems that two crucial signs have already been missed. Signs that were intended to bless us with abundance and prosperity. These signs may have been missed due to our own distractions, or perhaps we were not ready to receive them. Whatever the reason, it's essential to recognize that God's plans for us are always filled with love and compassion. Take care of yourself. Type yes if you're ready and share this video with five people who trust God. Comment. Jesus is Lord. To support our channel, please subscribe our channel and turn on bell notification.